Hey, kid. Turns out Eric's mum was a cockney. Oh, yeah? Yeah. He reckons that's why we spark off each other. Not bad on three pineapple and lemonades, is it? No, you're doing brilliant, Mum. It's nice to have a flirt. It makes you feel alive. You know, maybe you should give that Nathan a try. He's young, free and single, same as you. Last thing I need is a bloke. So what is this play you're going to see, then, you big culture vulture? I don't know. You know, if he'd said, let's go train spotting up Piccadilly Station, I'd be game on. I've got nothing to lose, have I? No, it's all coming together. You can give him the once over if you like. I'm meeting him later in the Rovers. Before curtain up, as they say in Lovey Land. Do you have to meet him in a boozer, Mum? It's curtain up, not bottoms up. You got your glad rags sorted, or will you be buying new? Oh, I wish. No, there's a little black dress knocking about. It's old as the hills, but he, he's not going to notice. You'll is it? knock him dead. <laughs> Thanks, love. Well, I best get cracking. Eric will think I'm taking advantage if I'm late. Donna's nose is right out of joint. <laughs> she keeps calling me the blue eye. I said, Donna, darling, they used to be red, believe me. <laughs> you know, the best bit about me and Eric is I'm mad Carol. Cockney Carol. I'm not Carol the Alky. I've got a clean sheet. I don't feel like some charity case or liability. You know what? That's the best I've seen her in ages. Fell out of her handbag. Hey? I asked her for rent. Do you think this is it and she's planning on surprising me? <laughs>